This video will cover the topic, Solving a Decimal Word Problem Using a Two-Step Linear Inequality. The first step in these problems is to set up an inequality based on the information given to us. After we do that, we can solve the inequality for our variable. Let's take an example problem. The problem says, For his phone service, Dale pays a monthly fee of $10, and he pays an additional $0.06 cents per minute of use. The least he has been charged in a month is $86.50. What are the possible numbers of minutes he has used his phone in a month? Let's begin by making an equation for how much the bill would be based off how many minutes used. We know that we have two costs. First, we have a flat rate of $10. And second, for each minute we use, our bill increases by $0.06. Cents. Our costs for all of the minutes used should be the amount of minutes used multiplied by the price per minute. So if we were to use the variable m to represent the number of minutes used, our cost for the minutes used should be 6 cents times m. So our total cost is just the cost for the minutes used plus the flat cost? Right. We can put our flat cost and our cost for all the minutes used together in order to make an equation for the total cost based off of minutes used. Now we look to set up our inequality. In our problem, it says that the smallest amount she has ever been charged is $86.50. This means that his bill has always been greater or equal to $86.50. We can use this information along with our equation for cost based on minutes used in order to set up the inequality. So his cost, shown in this equation, has always been greater than or equal to 86.5. Right. All we have left is to solve the inequality for m. First, we subtract 10 from both sides. This gives us 0 0.06 m is greater than or equal to 76.5. Next, we want to divide both sides by 0 0.06. Now we are left with m is greater than or equal to 1,275. When we do this, we get our final inequality for m which is that m must be greater than or equal to 1,275. This means that Dale always uses at least 1,275 minutes per month. So in order to solve a decimal word problem using a two-step linear inequality, the first step is to set up an inequality using an equation on one side and a fixed number on the other. And the second step is to solve the inequality for the variable. Correct. It looks like you understand this topic of solving a decimal word problem using a two-step linear inequality. 